Hey guys, welcome back to another Unreal Engine 4 tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do a custom UI for your progress bar or anything like that. So you can have your own custom images instead of just the default box, which looks quite boring after a while. So let's get straight into it. So first off, what I'm going to do is we're going to import our textures that we want. So import the images. So I'm going to do them from a stamina bar. So I've got a stamina empty and stamina fill bar, like so. And these I've just done like the uh, typical running man that you see. So now we're just going to set these and open them up like so. And you see I've got a transparent background, so it's PNG with no background. And then, then we're going to scroll down here and where it says level of detail, texture group, we're going to change that from world to UI like so. And hit save and do that on both of them or all of the ones you want. So change it from world to UI on the texture group, save and close those. Now I've already set up the sprinter mechanic and the stamina mechanic as well as the UI itself which I have tutorials on if you want to go watch those they'll be on screen now and at the end of the video and in the description down below. So I'm going to get my stamina bar here which would normally work and look like this so the stamina goes up, can go down, it doesn't look bad but if you want it to be more custom to you we can do that. So if you open it back up and then select the progress bar here and then under style we're going to open that up and open the background image and we're going to choose the pictures that we just imported so my background one would be stamina empty like so you can see that's now imported so you see the image size of this is 160 by 160 so I'm going to change the size of the stamina bar to be the same so 160 by 160 like that now that looks much better you see it works already and the margin set down to zero and then we'll just do the exact same for the fill image so change it to stamina fill and these are just two different shades to make it look different so you can tell the difference between them and I'm also just going to change from left to right down from uh, bottom to top so it feels like so and if we hit compile this should now work so we hit play we now have that down there and it goes up and down like so. I'm going to make it a bit bigger just so you can see it but this is just a very quick simple tutorial like that. So I make it 900 by 900 so it's still a perfect square like so. Anchor in the middle. Obviously you wouldn't want it like this. Again this is just as an example so you can see it better. So it fills up and it drains down. So now we have our own perfectly custom UI image which looks a lot better than just the default progress bar that you get with Unreal. So I think that'll be it for this video. We've done everything we want to do. We've set up the UI, we've customized the UI for ourselves and changed it so that it does still fill up and fill down how we want it to look and it just looks a lot better than a normal rectangle. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you found you helpful and if you did make sure to like and subscribe down below. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.